it's fascinating to, to hear and talk about John Cena's, you know, recovery, because it just feels like it's, it's never what you expect. And we've talked about his return from this pec tear on our no way out 2008 episode. So if you haven't heard that, I recommend you check it out at something to wrestle.com He's going to come back in pretty spectacular fashion. And I know that, you know, we start winding down, you know, you were only with the company a few more months and, and you've seen Cena go from the proto, the, the kid in the gym in California and doing the rap backwards thing and the rewind and prototype and the ruthless aggression slap and the rapper and the vanilla ice spoof and, and then the United States champion, then the world champion. And is it him or Batista? It's clearly him. I mean, you saw this guy become sort of in the modern version of Hulk Hogan right before your eyes here. Was he of, of that stint that you had with WWE? Was he like the last great sort of icon that you think, uh, you were a part of, of helping create with WWE? He was, and, you know, I still think to this day that John Cena is that icon and that guy, you know, that people still remember and love and appreciate and respect because he did it all. He was the man. He did every aspect of being the man from waking up or not even going to sleep to make the plane to go to Good Morning America or the Today Show to flying out, you know, finding a plane on his own to go and, and visit a sick kid. That's that's not hype. That's not PR. That's just John Cena. And John Cena is the kind of guy that takes his takes his job very seriously, takes himself very seriously without being too serious has a has a way about carrying himself and all of his business I'll, I'll never forget calling john when i was no longer with the company and just to share a story with him that my son had and john called me right back he was in san diego driving to the airport after a monday night raw i believe it was and i never thought I left John a message. I never thought in a million years he'd call me back. And he called me right back. And that's just John. John's that guy. John is that special. He he works hard. He, he Everything that he has, he deserves. And then some. Not afraid of hard work. And that's what made him the man. What made him the man was that he got up and he did everything. And then some, he found things to do. That's what makes the complete, you know, when you, people talk about being the guy in the company, John Cena was the guy. He did, he did it all and did it with a smile on his face and didn't refuse. Knew that's man. This is the gig. This is my responsibility and I'm going to do it. So, um, you know, to the haters out there, you have no idea the amount of work, the amount of effort, the amount of desire, the amount of passion that is John Cena. And I love the guy personally. I love him professionally. And he has proven time and time again why he deserves that, quote, spot. And he's gone on to do it in Hollywood and have people, man, you can count on Cena. Cena's going to step up and he'll do, he'll do what the others won't. And he'll do it better than they would too. So very happy for him. And again, again, seeing it coming up, you saw mm -hmm. this guy has it. This guy has that passion and desire. When I, I went to his house and saw all of the pairs of boots and trunks and knee pads that were different, he wore a different outfit every night to support the local team or the local college, wh whatever it was, and kept every one of them. Only wore them once and, and kept them. And his dad had them in, in this closet and showed them all to me. 
That's the kind of guy he was. And to this day, still is. He's still working hard. He's still nonstop. He's he's just going, going, going. And whenever you know you see something really good happen to the guy, instead of begrudging him, smile, be happy for him because I guarantee he worked his ass off to get it and he deserves it. John has to be one of your favorite performers you ever worked with. Is that fair to say? 100%. 100%. Definitely, you know, one of, and, and there's a few, you know, the, you got to throw Undertaker in there. You know, you got to throw Steve, you got to throw Rock, and, you know, now Cody. But there, there, are, there are guys, and John, just from day one, man, think about it. John Cena used to give me a, a ride. I think it was an Oldsmobile 88 mm. in California. Would give me a ride back to the airport. Had no air conditioning, and the passenger side window didn't work. Didn't go down. But I enjoyed that ride and appreciated it so much um, because he took that time to ask me questions. He took that time to to talk about the business, to learn. And I always just appreciated the hell out of that. And at that point, he was prototype. And I thought, God, this is horrible. This is going to kill you, kid. Um, but he had he had the passion. He had the desire. And getting to know him, I discovered that passion. I discovered that drive that he had and appreciated him all the, that much more. You said that Cena was uh, nonstop, and we've also talked about his super recovery period. Hey, hey, it's Conrad Thompson here to tell you a little more about what adfreeshows.com is all about. Get early ad-free access to more than a dozen of your favorite wrestling podcasts every single week, starting at just nine bucks. That's less than 20 cents an episode each month. And yes, you can listen to them all directly through Apple Podcasts or your regular podcast apps. How easy is that? Ad-Free Shows also has thousands of hours worth of bonus content and docu-series like Title Chase, Eric Fires Back, Conversations with Conrad, and The Insiders. Plus new series like The Book with David Crockett, Monday Mailbags with Mike Chioda and Nick Patrick, and a whole lot more. And you want to talk about early, you can't get any earlier than listening to the shows live. You can be a part of the live studio audience as we record the podcast. Plus, ride shotgun alongside your favorite childhood heroes for live watch-alongs, Q&As, and other interactive experiences every single month. Come on now, see for yourself what thousands of other wrestling fans from around the world have discovered that adfreeshows.com is the best value in wrestling. Check it out today, and hey, when you do, the first week is completely free, adfreeshows.com. <laughs> 